Hello and a warm welcome from the English West Midlands. We find ourselves at Molyneux. I'm Derek Ray and joining me in the commentary position is the former England defender Lee Dixon. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers up against Arsenal. Well, thank you, Derek. Glorious atmosphere here. Really looking forward to it. The fans are too. The players look like they're up for it. This could be end to end. We could get goals today, Derek. Well, so many arrows in this man's quiver. Ruben Neves. Lee, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, if I'm a teammate of this lad, I want to get the ball to him as often as I can because he's a safe pair of hands. Give him the ball, normally something happens. The link-up play between the different departments of the team is second to none. The initial 11 for Wolves. In goal, it's Rui Patricio. Joao Moutinho plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Bernd Leno is the goalkeeper. David Luiz starts with Rob Holding in defence. Thomas Partey starts with Granit Xhaka in the centre of the pitch. And leading the line today, Alexandre Lacazette. And the game begins. Moutinho. Neto. It's with Moutinho. Roman Saiz. The ball with Podence. And a good looking ball. And David Luiz gets in the way. Elects to go short. And pulled back. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Tione. Well, he went strongly into the challenge and the result is a throw-in. Lacazette. It is to be a throw-in. Adama. Podence. An important interception. Alas, a wild, wild attempt. Well, after that effort, I'm not sure whether he's right or left-footed. Lacazette holding now Bukayo Saka not getting anxious when they have the ball dangerous looking attack Lacazette and the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger Nelson Semedo 
the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. End product or not. Options in the centre. Now sliding in field. And he's taken it away. It's Wolves' turn now. Ruben Neves. Podence. No space for them here. Nelson Semedo. This looks promising. Really good challenge. Deflected behind. Corner forthcoming. What about the opportunity from earlier? Let's have another look now, shall we? They take it short. A really top-notch piece of defending. A move of promise on the flank. Another chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. He's driven in the corner. Well, he'd love to have that header back. In fairness, he was being closely watched. Lacazette looking for that final pass looking for the goal that would put them ahead and return to Aubameyang Lacazette oh it was a close run thing but the goalkeeper just got there first so two minutes of stoppage time to be added on read it well A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Podence. And Wolves in a position of menace. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that. And it was close. Well, it's all about timing. You've got to wait for the ball to come down and he's very, very unlucky. Thomas Granite Jacker Bukayo Saka Well probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag Well it's not been a great Must take the lead here and they have you've got to say it has been coming
Well, here it is again. It looks a simple goal. He gets in a position not that far out from goal, but he has to hit the target. He does that, and it's in the back of the net. Substitution time it is. So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. Wolves' possession stats are brilliant. After that, it's been a little bit disappointing. Creativity in midfield is a little bit off. Certainly too slow in front of goal. Need to get wide, need to get crosses in the box. And an astute piece of defending. Can they hit on the break? Half an hour remaining then. And that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. And Wolves coming away with it. Moutinho. Willy Boli. Fabio Silva. Determined defending. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Now they've lost it. Oh, great vision. Intercepting it intelligently. Nelson Semedo. Chance to play it in. Moutinho. Robbed them. And breaking at pace with Menace. Well, it fizzled out. And since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. And he's in. In search of space. The net is staring him in the face. And oh, he's missed it. Good heavens. Well, what a chance for an equaliser, Derek. At this level, you don't get many chances. And that was one of them. Well, all my goalkeepers I played in front of always say the woodwork is your friend. Absolutely on that occasion. Well, body in the way. This could be it. And it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. Well, as we see again here, the damage is started with a beauty of a through ball, and he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard.
And the substitution will occur now. It's going their way, 2-0. And it's a case of just five minutes left. It's been a thoroughly cogent and convincing performance in this match, Lee. Wow, well, Arsenal tonight, creativity has been absolutely fantastic. Their imagination, their delivery, their execution, a real top-draw performance. Chance after chance they've created. Obama Yang! In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, here we see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and then the brute force and guile in equal amounts sets up the chance to score. And he doesn't disappoint, does he? Well, it's been such a one-sided game. You just wonder how many more they could add. Silva. And the referee decides enough is enough. It's the end of the game. And Arsenal victorious. That's the main headline from this one, Lee. Well, being potent up front gives you a great chance in any game. And there was certainly that today. Sharp, clinical and exciting to watch for sure. So, fruitful as far as Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang is concerned. Lee, how would you sum up his performance? Well, that was a really, really good performance from the lad and a goal to boot. Really delighted with that goal, I'm sure he is. 